we're here at Open Mobile Summit and I'm here with Larry uh, Atwell. He's the Director of Product Development at Cricket Communications. Mm -hmm. Hello, Larry. Hello. <laughs> Hi, thanks for speaking to us. So, sure. what brings you to Open Mobile Summit? Uh, this is my third year, actually. Um, we usually come here to talk to the content developers, um, speak to my peers in the industry and find out what they're working on, what the buzz is, um, what are some of the issues that need to be solved for, um, and whatnot. And so it's just keeping in touch with what's going on in the industry, pretty much. And then, so you were here talking about App Carousel, we'll get mm -hmm. on to that, but mm -hmm. um, what is sort of the direction you're heading into to you know, provide your customers with um, additional services? Well, with um, the, the, our device mix skewing really heavily towards um, smartphones, we're a CDMA carrier, and, and up until, say, first part of uh, this year, um, we were a feature phone company, and then we got into the smartphone game, um, and that now with all the applications that you have on smartphones, we are really focusing on finding out which application really re uh, resonates with our demographic and finding out you know, what application services are relevant to our, our demographic and then presenting that to them. Okay. Is this is this done presumably through some kind of analytics tool? How are you, how are you gathering this sort of information to ensure you're giving your customer what they want? Um, one way we do that is uh, we've segmented our customer base. So we have I think five different profiles, anywhere from the um, the techie balancer, or the, I'm sorry, the busy balancer to the simple saver. So we've segmented our customer base into five different segments, and with that information, coupled with our demographic information, we have a pretty good idea idea of what type of applications and services our customers are looking for. As example, I said in the presentation, you know, BMW, Jaguar ads and or type of content probably wouldn't be relevant, but would be relevant is a bunch of entertainment applications, game applications, and of course, um, Cricket launched their first, you know, mobile focus music offering, mu Move Music, earlier this year. So. We keep in touch with our customers, we do a lot of focus groups and we just ask a lot of questions and have a look out there in the industry and see what's there. Okay, and we heard from Light Squared yesterday that they want to be the dumbest pipe ever. <laughs> Clearly, um, is this not a strategy that cricket is pursuing? Um, I, I was at that presentation. I, I'm not sure all the carriers would agree that uh, we want to be a dumb pipe. I think um, it's probably a better position to be a semi-smart pipe. And w what I mean by that is provide our customers you know s services that resonate with them um, but leverage our developer community to do that um, I, th I think it's better to you know not try and be all things to them um, but find a good application developer promote them on the, our home screen do some in-store co-marketing programs with them and provide value that way Okay, um, so you were here talking about the app carousel mm -hmm. uh, today. Um, can you talk us through uh, what that is and um, what the strategy is with, with app carousel? Well, it's a, it's a new application that our partners, WMOD, um, has just introduced at this conference. And what it solved for me is um, it helps our customers discover applications and content that's relevant relevant to them it helps me provide recommendations to our customers so that if they haven't heard of a certain game and that we feel it really resonates with them we can um, recommend or promote that to our um, our subscriber base um, you know discovery recommendations um, actively merchandising the content is um, also really important to us no one wants to go to say you know one of their stores or favorite stores to go shopping and see the same content so if you can do that re refreshing of the content you know on a regular basis everyone benefits including the content uh, developer community well what are your what are your first impressions of how it's going um, well, we haven't launched um, App Carousel yet. They're still doing some devel um, development and testing. But for Cricket, I think the first um, the first product as a result of understanding what our customer base wants is our, our Move Music product. You know, for fifty five dollars a month, you get unlimited um, music downloads, ringtones, or ring back tones. Um, I think if you speak to our customers and as well as you know content developers like Game Loft, you know we we do very well. We over index. Most 
most carriers in the United States with gaming type of content. So right now we do have a lot of free content, but we also have you know a fair share of paid content, and that seems to have been working well. So it's it's not hit and miss. It's more I really truly understanding your customer base and providing those services out there um, for our demographic that makes sense.